Val's kitchen where Val always said tears on a pot. Hi guys, this is Val and welcome back for another video. But I still have tears on a pot in a welcome back guys. Where my internet niece Diva and big up yourself, Diva and anyway you are today. Big up yourself, more blessings to you. So what is on the menu for today? I'm gonna be doing something that you can use. A kind of glaze, sorry, glaze, you know, sorry, and I make a glaze from it. You can use it on your ham, your chicken, your pork, your beef, anything that you bake, you can glaze it and make your thing nice and turn up nicely for your Christmas. So, I have a little recipe that I'm gonna, I have a little recipe that I'm, I say I'm gonna share with my aunt, but you know, I'm gonna share with my supporters. So, here are all my ingredients over here that I'm gonna be using to make my nice glaze so come with me man and stay with me all right all right so here's my cereal right it's less than a pound they say it's three or five kilogram because i didn't buy it in the market i buy it in the supermarket it's less than a pound so it's more nearer to a pound all right you can use a dry one and if you cannot get the fresh one like i have you can use a dry cereal all right you can use a dry one and i still get a nice glaze from it just as it is all right so i'm gonna be using some cinnamon leaves you can use cinnamon sticks but i don't have any stick so i'm gonna use the leaf right i'm gonna use the leaves see the amount of leaf i just want to flavor to turn up on a couple of seeds of fermenter if you don't have fermenter seeds you can use the cloves yes you can use cloves I have ginger. I'm gonna get about a tablespoon of ginger from this when I grate it. I'm gonna get about a tablespoon. I'm gonna wash it, wash everything, and start out everything. I have an orange. Wash my orange and use the zest and the juice at the same time. All right. Now I use a little red label. Turn up the flavor. You don't must eat enough, but I'm gonna use it. I have to have some sugar. Yeah and have some corn starch, some corn starch. And so, um, this, I need a little salt. Yeah. A little salt to wash my cereal. I'll definitely will be separate the things on it. You just get them off thoroughly. Yeah, so, let's wash them nicely. As I said already, my guys, you can use the dry one now. You cannot get the um, the first one. You can use the dry one. Yeah. Come on, come on, let me see you now. Let's see how it's Because I'm going to take out some of the stuff out of the shell and all of it easy enough. But by my knowledge, I know, I know that you have to take out, take out the inside part. Majority, I don't know if you take out it. Most of them come out, but see. Some of them don't come out, so I'm going to take them out. Some water, I'm gonna use about three cups of water now. Alright, so sorry to wash. So uh -oh. I 
super good. I love you. Alright, so I'll wash my stuff. Leaves. A few um, seeds of grains of pimenta, you know, not a lot. You know, pimenta seeds are very strong. We don't want, it's not a lot of fire, so we don't want a lot of pimenta seeds. So, it's about eight, eight seeds of pimenta. Yeah, so let me just scrape on the skin from my ginger. I am gonna use six. It's a sin. I bought a five hundred dollar good tea. But I have a little ginger here. I have some ginger from the other day. I got always have ginger because my always cook with ginger. You know. Ginger, I think you get out everything you know instead of to cut it up, cut it up, cut it up, cut it up. Great tight, you know, you get out everything. Yeah. yeah. Oh my goodness, it's to come out so nice. And you know, I'm gonna put it on and get this nice flavor. No, we can just drop it in the pot. This, you know, just drop this in the pot and I'm gonna throw it away. I'm saying I was I didn't know I 
don't know if you are here, but if you're doing more, you know you have to put more ingredients. Yes, and double or triple the ingredients. Alright? Yes. So you can turn it off now. In a minute, it's been a good while. In more minutes. <laughs> when it's been a minute, it's been a long time. Alright, so I'm gonna turn off the stove. I'm gonna strain it off. Alright. I'm gonna strain off my saril. If you have time, if you have the time, then you can let it stay. But it don't boil out. All the substance, all the goodness don't boil out already. So don't have to soak it. Let it sit. I don't have to let it sit anymore. It's good. All right? Mm -hmm. So turn everything. Get this out of this pot. Rinse all about the pot. And then to the next process. All right? Smells so 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 awesome. You know what I need? I need some slurry. So I'm gonna use about a tablespoon of cornstarch. Alright? Tablespoon of cornstarch with a little of water. Of this nice, big, rich, yeah, don't want it to water it. This is good. This is a lot. Alright, so I'm going to go back to the store. I'm going to add in my sugar. Put in all my nice, lovely ingredients. Okay, come with me. So I'm adding back my cereal juice, cereal drink. Wow. For the, the orange zest and the juice is to give it a sweet and sour taste. Yeah. So we're gonna mix it all. Let this come to a syrupy, syrupy consistency. Yeah. Feel it already. Now you feel the thickness already. Uh -huh. So stir, stir, stir. Consistency, and then we can add in our cornstarch, add in our little wine, and thing it up nicely. And you know, yeah. All right. All 
Okay, so we are somewhere now. I'm gonna put in my little slurry. Card starch. If you don't have card starch, you can use a little flour in it. Just a little flour. You don't want to kill the flavor, all right? Just a little bit. You don't want a nice flavor to stand up. All right. So, I'm not going to use that. I'm going to use a little bit of this. I'm going to use 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 this. I'm going to that's a liar, but Jamaica no problem. Just leave it and make a problem consume. You know? Yeah. Look at this place. Look at this. Oh my word. Let's put it in some of the lowest of the lowest heat. Yeah. Oh my king. So I'm gonna put in my orange juice. I don't want my orange juice, but boil out but, um, too much you know because I still want the flavor to stand up in it stand up not stand out <laughs> uh. mm. guys you all must try this is a must I'm gonna put about a tablespoon of my red label This is a must try guys, put it on your ham, mm -hmm. your chicken, your pork, anything that you're taking. This is a must must, this sauce is so awesome, this glaze, oh my word, oh my word. So the cornstarch now, just let the cornstarch cook for about two minutes, okay, and then we can turn up our flame. That is. This is so pretty. Uh, this is so awesome. Yeah. Come on. I'm gonna put in my orange juice. My orange juice. Tell me how this look man. For the you could just taste it. You taste the ginger, you taste the cinnamon, you taste the oh my god, it taste everything. Everything. So I'm gonna transfer it back to, to something else. And I just want it to just get another couple seconds boiling. Couple seconds boiling. I just love this. I'm not sharing this with my nice people, I mean, I have to, you know, so turn it off, get the nice consistent that we need, because that is good enough, and we can turn on the stove now, alright, so I'm going to pour back my, my glaze back in this container, alright, look at the consistency, and I can store this. Wow, real syrup. Sorry, syrup. <laughs> Sorry, syrup. That sounds good.
superb taste. You don't have to put any wine in it. You don't have to use any wine. But you know you want to turn up a little bit. I put the wine and then I let it boil. So the, the wine comes like it boil out. Okay? The, the, uh, the, uh, the, this alcohol flavor, you know, it's not as high in it as you know you think. So you can store it. You can we can store it in the refrigerator because it has the preservative, it has the wine, you know, the alcohol preserves things. So you can have it in the fridge as long as you want ginger in it. Yes, preservative. So, yes, your ham, your chicken, your pork, your beef. This is an awesome glaze, guys. This is awesome. So, thanks again for watching. Give me a big fat thumbs up on this one. Thank you all again for watching. Subscribe. Subscribe to the channel now. Give me the 20k for my birthday, man. Go on, it in guys, please. 20k for my birthday. Thanks, to, thanks again. Thanks again for watching. See you all in the next video. And bye.